everyone, welcome back to Nightly Nerds. I'm Tote. And I'm Ginger. And we're playing... Hollow Knight. Hollow Knight. And, uh, through, uh, Tote bending and twisting, breaking my arm, <laughs> made me go get my, uh, my soul guy back, as well as finish up the, uh, finish up the little collection of that... The Tree little, thingy? Little dream catchers. Dream catcher, dream thing. Alright, so we're gonna end up going back into green path. Oh, jeez. It, it does do damage. That's cool. So it'll kill most tiny things. This place is so pretty. Oh, man, yeah, we haven't been here in forever. Okay, but we're going down to that little fire. Gotcha. Won't take us very long because traveling down is not nearly as long as traveling, traveling up. up. Hi there, Mr. Bushbug. Oh, I remember you. Do 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 be do be. You ever heard that song? Yeah. So we can make it on the poor side of town. I love that song because I, I I never really paid attention to it when I'd hear it when I was younger. But li listening to it recently, it's such a like oh, he's kind of a douche. The main guy. Oh, yeah. There's a girl who just, like, broke up with the rich guy that she was going out with, and he's kind of like, oh, look who's back. Couldn't make it on your own, huh? Oh. Yeah, you left me for that rich guy. But da -da -da -da. And at the end of it, he's like, but you know what? I, I still want to be with you because I don't blame you for going because it makes sense for you to try to make it out of the poor side. So we'll go. Now that you're back, you can stick with me and we'll make it together. I mean, it's not that, but it's kind of like the first part of it. He's kind of like rubbing it in her face. Yeah. That she didn't make it. Okay, so we're gonna get the top They can't off. bring me down. Okay, I need to go down a little Together bit more. Together we can make it on the poor side of town. Kaboom! Sheesh. Whoop. Turn it into like Cheeto dust. Oh, I haven't had Cheeto dust in so long. The things you miss. I can actually have that, or at least a version of it. It's just cheese. I just can't have the, the corn chip part. Blow up. This guy's a little easier because once I build it up, build up enough, he needs a little fireball. Yeah, you can nail him because there's not a wall in the way. Yep. Blow up. <laughs> Nicely done. What are the little Cheeto chips called in uh, Over the Hedge? Oh, I don't remember. I love that movie. They usually just refer to them as cheese puffs in most cases. Yeah, there, there's a name for them, like in the show. Oh, I forgot I can't duck. <laughs> I've been playing too much Bloodstained. Ah, Bloodstained. Alright, now we just gotta go get the last one. Which I want to get this before we press on because it's gonna be further down, eh? He'll be he'll be an, another source of damage. Okay, so the shitty up to you. So we just gotta go back up and then across. Okay. And then there's this other little guy that we need to visit. I can't remember exactly where he is, but he gives us these um these charms that'll like we'll do more damage. We can farm more geo, but if we die, they break and we have to go get him repaired. Because, huh. yeah, when uh, technically when you die and you, you know, you split between your little shadow and you, yeah, there's this big explosion cracky of energy, and so it causes th these fragile charms to break. Which I thought was a neat little, uh, neat little thing to throw in the game. All right, so now we just go straight across. Yeah, we just go straight across. And there's a bench nearby too. So huzzah! Mr. Mosquito, you can't dive bomb me. Man, what the hook gonna be? Oh, it didn't work. He's so infatuated Sorry, by his I'm phone. Sorry, I'm just looking something up. So infatuated by his phone. 
Nope, that's the acid. Ah. Man, what the hook gonna be? <laughs> but I don't even been looking at me. <laughs> there you go, you happy? Yes. All I need is a check in the background. It's, it's one of those tricks I taught your sister that, like, she giggles every time we're all around. All I have to do is sing any kind of song, and I can't help. If you don't end it, I have to at least start it. Well, there, there's a few that are big, big triggers for Tote, and one of them is that one, which you've told me the reference many times. I've never actually seen the movie. That, that was not from a movie. It's, um... Oh, it was one of the guys who's part of Nelly's crew back in the day. Oh, okay. And then the other one is uh, Eve Six. <laughs> yes. That one will always get you going. Spuddies, that's what they're called. Spuddies? Yeah. So potato Cheetos? Yeah, like che nacho Cheeto potato chip or something. But I just love the like, like with Spuddies, enough. It's never enough. <laughs> That's true with any potato chip, though. Yeah. Zoom! I was never big on chips, though. I've never been a chip guy. Like, I'm... Sandwiches, either? I'm weird like that. Like, no more I would kill for a sandwich now because I haven't had one in nine months, but... Because I just haven't had bread. Yeah. But... I mean... Oh, yeah, i just never been big on sandwiches, potato... Or, I mean, I love chips, but, like... I was never a person who would like just sit down with a bag of chips. My sister, she loves chips. That's like her hardest thing to give up. But um there's a couple other things oh, that I like. Oh, come on. <laughs> a couple other things I'm not really big on either like uh like breakfast. Like uh sweet pancakes breakfast. and waffles and we nice. talked about that last week, right? Yeah. Like I've been strangely craving pancakes recently, which is of all the of the three Ow. main like pan pancakes, waffles and um French toast was like my, my bottom one, but for some reason I really want it. Ooh, look, it's a little caddy pillar. It was your bottom, bitch? Yep, power bottom, though. I love the noise the freaking Grim Child makes. It's freaking cute. Ah, uh, uh, the Grim Child. I didn't go all the way down like it Nicely. We Oh, Are right in. kidding me? Better heal up. That was the wrong button. Shoot a beam into the nothing. That was the wrong button. Snarf, snarf. That's for something that's reminding me of that. A little bit. Not as annoying, but. Not as, yeah, not as annoying. That was one thing about the. Uh, Thundercats. The little Thundercats. Well, the, the 80s. Um, cartoons and early 90s. Oh, that's right. I couldn't make it this way. Where they would occasionally throw in, like, some. Weird character like that, as like, this will appeal to the younger children. And no, no, it no, didn't. No, it wasn't. It just everybody hated those characters. Everyone hated Snarf, except for they they did it right with uh with Shira. Freaking uh, what's his name? The little wizard dude. Warbo. I mean, you talking about He Man? No, in in uh in Shira, there's like a little wizard guy. Nope. Not the new one. Should be. Not so far. There's Orko or whatever. Orko, that's the one. That's 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 Masters of the Universe. Is that that's Masters of the Universe? Yeah. Probably made an appearance in Shira at some point too. Probably. I'm sure there's some crossover. I mean they're both this they're it's essentially the same guy. thing. It's just the girl version of He Man. This guy is creepy. He's all creepy looking. <laughs> yeah, perfect. This works out great, so his name is Leg Eater. Oh, ew. So I'm trying to sneak past me, I can smell you. Collect a lot of Geo, give me Geo, and, I, and you can see something nice. Yeah. Only 86. Yeah, we were meant to, like, bump into him earlier. I just ended up skipping past him. Okay, so if we pay him, he gives us... It will make you stronger, your enemies, and everyone else will fear you less. Or fear, fear you at last. Uh, uh, what is it? Hold this charm and get more geo. And then this one is either way, we're gonna we're gonna buy that one. Yeah. Then we'll have enough to buy that one. Will it work out that we can actually buy oh almost. Let's let's go kill a couple of things. We'll get all three of them. We're looking at the time in this episode. That's almost ten minutes. Okay. 
So we'll uh, we'll collect these, take a little peeky at them, and then we'll end. Sweet. And we should be able to finish our Grim Child at the end of this session. Woohoo! There you go, that should do it. Yeah, that did it. Ow! Right into the acid! It's okay, the last, poison, the last plate I was technically standing was the entrance of this, so it worked out. Ta-da! So then we sit here and we got, okay, so this one is, increases the health of the bearer, allowing you to take more damage. Find more Geo when defeating enemies. Strengths the bearer, uh, they increase damage dealt. So it's cool, it's awesome. Yeah, you're not gonna them. use them, but you have them. But I have them. Is that oh, gonna end this episode? That is gonna end this episode. All right, everyone, that'll yeah. end this episode of Nightly Nerds. As always, I'm Tote. And I'm Ginger. And we'll catch you guys on the flippy flippy. Bye bye. Hey, did you like that video? Well, if you did, click the box on the right for another. Click the box on the left for a playlist. Of course, you could always just subscribe by clicking the link in the middle. Come find us on social media. There are links in the description below. Don't be afraid to leave us a comment. Thanks for watching. I'm Tote. I'm Ginger. See you then. Bye.